Today's topic is neck pain. Neck pain is a pain or aches in the neck area and stiffness in the neck muscle. Neck pain is a common problem, and almost everybody experiences neck pain at some point in their life. The lower neck and upper neck creates a support system for the head to sit on. If this support system is affected due to an injury or inflammation, the muscle in this area will tighten, leading to neck pain. The pain may radiate down to the shoulder or between the shoulder blades. The pain may also radiate out into the arm, the hand, or up into the head, causing a headache that is either one-sided or double-sided. Neck pain affected 5% of the population in 2010. Causes Neck pain can be triggered by Head injury Whiplash from road traffic accidents Muscle strains that result from overuse of neck muscles. This can be caused by a poor neck position while sleeping, sitting at a desk for a long time, particularly computer work, degenerative disc disease, herniated disc, certain types of cancer, pinched nerve, stress, physical or emotional stress, minor injuries or falls, such as during sporting events, rheumatoid arthritis, osteoporosis, cervical spondylitis, cervical spine fracture, mononucleosis, spinal stenosis, infections such as epiglottitis, torticollis, ankylosing spondylitis, fibromyalgia, meningitis, subarachnoid hemorrhage, polio, Paget's disease of the bone, polymyalgia rheumatica. Symptoms. Pain in the neck that is often worsened by holding the head still for prolonged periods, such as when driving or working at a computer. Muscle tightness and spasm. Nerve pain. Headaches. Reduced range of motion. Soreness. You should seek help for a medical emergency if pain is severe. Persist for days without relief. Radiates to the arms or legs. Is accompanied by a headache, numbness, weakness, or tingling. Is accompanied by pain behind one eye. Diagnosis and treatment. Your doctor may be able to determine the cause of neck pain from your medical history and physical examination. The doctor will check for tenderness, numbness, and muscle weakness. The doctor may also use tests such as x-rays, MRI, and CT scan to find the exact cause of the pain. These scans can assess the spine and be used to show problems in the nerve. Blood tests can also be used to provide evidence of inflammatory conditions that may be contributing to the neck pain. Electrocardiography tests may also be used to evaluate the electrical activity in the nerves. This may help to determine whether specific nerves are working. Treatment. Treatment options depend on the cause of the neck pain. Mild neck pain usually resolves with self-care within two to three weeks. If this does not work, prescription medications and muscle relaxants may be recommended by your doctor. Physical therapy where you are taught correct posture, alignment, and neck straightening exercises and other measures may help to relieve the pain. Local injection of corticosteroid into the muscles in your neck may also help with pain. Surgery is rarely needed but may be an option for relieving spinal cord compression. Home remedies such as jacuzzi treatment, neck pain relief exercises and stretches, neck pain relief products such as neck pillow may also be helpful. Thank you for watching our video. Please do not forget to like and share the video. Also, please subscribe to the channel to stay updated on our latest videos.